everyone, it's Reed here yet again. We have the box in the back, and of course we have Alexa. Good morning. Alexa, good morning. Good morning. It always takes Today two times. Today is World Vegetarian Day. So why not put down that steak knife, pick up a salad fork, and give peas a chance? Peas? Peas? Anyway, guys, it looks like it's that time. It's time for yet another exciting, insane, super official, thought-provoking food product review from YouTube's only Straight Edge 365 day a year food product review. We do it 365 days a year. Today, people, we have something I've never heard of before, but it says it is a southern classic it's true aid carolina punch check that out that is a beautiful bottle i picked this up for 89 cents at my local bp gas station um 70 calories no high fructose corn syrup and it says with natural and artificial flavors so it's good to know that the artificial flavors are still there because we all know that's what Americans love the most, right? Right. Alexa, what is artificial flavors? A response from an Amazon customer about Loran's best-selling flavors, five, says, I'm not sure. It just says natural and artificial flavors. Did that answer your question? No. Uh, anyway, guys... We're going to give this a review and see just what it's all about. See what the True Aid tastes like. It's a Southern classic I've never heard of before. I love the blue color. There's so many different flavors of this. I picked up the blue because Kentucky blue, of course. So, as always, guys, remember if you have anything you'd like, read the box, like, extra review. you got to leave a comment below. If we like that, come pick up that comment and review your request next. Thumbnail. Now, guys, before we open this up, just imagine. Look at this right here. You see this? Imagine something this thick and this big. Okay, just imagine something. You see something this thick and this big. Just imagine you're walking in one night, your bedroom, and your ex, your your wife at the time is there, of course, and you walk in and you're shocked. And there's like a big black 12-inch BBC just ramming her against the bedpost. And you hear like a thumping like this. Every time he rams her, it's like, Now just imagine walking in and seeing that, people. That's what I experienced that night when the ex-wife cheated on me with Malcolm. Uh, but anyway, guys, let's just get to the review. Just imagine that, you know, when you see something bigger than that. It's pretty big. Anyway, let's open it right up. Oh, did you hear that, people? It busted a nut. I like the top of the lid here, uh, the lead, lid, whatever, it says USA. Greatest country in the mar in a <laughs> greatest country in America, <laughs> greatest country in the world, <laughs> the United States of America. True aid, people. Here we go. Oh, mm, that is sweet. Wow. Check this out, people. I found this on the internet. Let's see. Check this out. That is sweet. Back to nature, change true aid. The iron drink drink made made for oranges. True aid was not contaminated. True aid is back to nature, change soft drink. The iron drink drink made made for oranges. There you go. <laughs> anyway, uh, <laughs> it tastes, um, tastes kind of like a diet soda. Not diet diet, but it's, you can taste, you can really, you can really feel there's not, um, a lot of sugar in it. It's got 19 grams of, 19 carbs in it, 16 sugars. It's got an amazing smell. 
absolutely amazing. It smells great, looks great. But I'm telling you what, the taste is not there. It kind of reminds me, I know this sounds stupid, but it reminds me of like a, like a Monster Zero. I mean, that's actually what it, that's what it tastes like to me. <laughs> Ain't that weird? <laughs> that's what it does. That's, I just figured that out. I was like, what's that taste like? I've had that before. It tastes like a Monster Zero. <laughs> just imagine those monster drinks with uh, no sugar. That's a weird way of looking at it, but it kind of does taste like that. Hmm. Now I do wonder, people. Hmm. Non-carbonated and caffeine-free. I will not know how to explain it, people. I think, I think when I explained it like that, that's kind of the flavor I'm getting here with this. Uh, just imagine that. No. Uh, it's like a Monster Zero, Red Bull Zero. It's something like that. I mean, that's odd. Who would expect a flavor like that coming from this? Not me. Alexa, when was True Aid invented? Nothing. Alexa, Alexa's not working right today, are we? So anyway, guys, let's... Sorry, I'm not sure. You're not sure. Alexa, when was True Aid invented? Hmm. She don't, I don't know. know that one. I don't know either. But there we have it, people. It's True Aid. It's made with real sugar. Maybe that's what gives it a unique flavor because, as I've said before, people, back when they had that Pepsi with real sugar and the Mountain Dew with real sugar, those drinks, they just they didn't taste the same because, of course, my generation and and now, most generations now, of course, or whatever, most kids now and back then, we were raised in those 80s and 90s, we were raised when it was all fake sugars. Nothing was real in these sodas back then. It was all fake, artificial flavors. Now they're kind of adding real flavors with artificial flavors, and it's giving it a unique flavor, no doubt about it. I'm sure this tasted different back when it first came out. You know it did. Guess. I think the best way to describe this would be a Monster Zero. I really do. Even though this has carbs in it and some sugar, still, it's kind of got that flavor. That's different. I had no idea, people, what to expect from True Aid. Where is True Aid made? Carolina Canners, Sheerall, South Carolina, carolinacanners.com. Hmm. So it's another American made product, people. Um, I don't know what they're expecting with this product. I guess it's been around a long time. It's a Southern classic, so I've never heard of it. And I was raised in the South. So I don't know what to think, people. It's, that's a very unique soda. Just don't taste alone, I'm gonna have to say. Let's take one more drink over here and we'll give it a official review. Alexa, what's the oldest soda ever made? Sorry, I don't know that one. Alexa, when was the first soda invented? Drink of soft drink is something that was invented in 1767. That's what it was. Drink. Never heard of that. Anyway, guys, I'm going to give this three stars. I had no idea what to expect when I bought this. And uh, it's unique. That's all I can pretty much say about it. It's worth a shot. It's true aid. And if you want me to review the other flavors, there's... God, there's five different flavors I think I saw at the BP. It was only... It was less than a dollar. Pretty good flavor. Uh, reminds me a lot of uh, those monster energy drinks, the zero drinks is what it reminds me of. I mean, that's weird. That is weird. It's like Monster Zero before they was Monster Zero. Wow.
So anyway, guys, that's going to be the official review. As always, thanks so much for watching, of course, me, The Box, and Alexa. We're going to see you tomorrow, as always, with another exciting review. Have yourselves a great day, guys. We do it 365 days a year. This is Reed, also known as Mr. Sody Pop. We'll see you tomorrow, as always. Have a great day now. Toodles. Alexa, tell me a joke. What do you say when you bumped into a unicorn at a party? Ouch. Oh. She, she tries to be funny, people. She just, she just doesn't have it, does she, Bob? No, Alexa's just not funny. Let's just give Alexa one more chance here. Alexa, tell me a joke. Why didn't the emoji cross the road? He was feeling a little meh. Anyway, guys, uh, let's see if third time is a charm. This is very good. Do I taste but do I taste butterscotch? I taste it a little bit, and I like it. That's very good. I like how it's limited edition. Of course, this is going to be something that's only going to be out probably through the holidays.